Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Sound Test Room. Today, we're going to take a look at how to set up a garage band with uh, an MPE controller. So, I'm using the Seaboard block, and uh, I want to set garage band up for full MPE control. Okay, so when they first updated uh, Garage Band, Garage Band, okay, Garage Band of English, um, they added the support. So, when I first uh, set this up, I went to Alchemy just to see what it was like. So, uh, in, in, into Alchemy. So, first of all, I need to what I need to do is switch my uh, seaboard on. You just hold that there, and you'll, I don't know if you can see what the little uh, Bluetooth indicator will flash, and then you need to go to settings here and go to advanced. Okay, and then choose bluetooth midi devices and then you can tap on that and it will connect okay so now theoretically we should have control over alchemy and when i first bit this and I, I i i i put pressure on i thought oh yeah great but then i wasn't getting anything else and i thought well this is weird so I thought that I'd go to the uh, some of the like instruments here, like the and I'm not getting hardly any glide. The octaves work, and I'm not getting the vibrato neither anyway what they don't tell you what they don't make very clear is to set this up properly you need to go to settings here and in your general settings area here you can scroll down until you see um where is it uh garage band there and you can tap on that and in the settings there is support mpe controllers i don't know if you can see that let me see if i can Zoom that in a little bit. So it says support MPE controllers, and you just need to switch that on. And then we can go back to um, Garage Band and. And we have full MP control, MPE control, which is uh, just great now. Fantasticals. So I could do all of vibrato. And full full range slides as well, epic. So I'm very happy <laughs> that that was at, at something that I'd done wrong. So then I wanted to know if um, it would control an audio unit, in particular uh, the Noise AU. Um, where are we there? So I thought, well, I'll, I'll give that a, I'll give that a try there. So I set noise up, okay, and let's choose. Um, Oh, I know there's a nice some nice ones in the fundamentals. Um, if you can find it there, the basic pack that you get. So, breath flute. So you can see we have full the full MP, MP control over noise as well. And then the next thing I wanted to know is how can I record all the gestures and everything so it's all it's all saved. So we'll just give that a quick a quick go. I'm gonna sec.
So now we can go back to our song and we can see if the actual... Now, you won't see it in the MIDI, but hopefully... And I, I have tried this and he did record it last time, so, you know. So there you go, guys. Setting up um, an MP controller in GarageBand works great. Once you go to settings and switch on MP uh, support MP controllers, and that was the thing that threw me at first. I never did that, and I don't need to connect this via the uh, noise app or anything like that because, um, like I said, you can just go to advanced in the in the help there and you the settings for bluetooth midi devices so i mean there are lots of bluetooth midi devices now so as long as it's it's done you're uh, good to go so that's it um i think um also it, it just works the same with animog and um also model 15 and other things are added working great with the synthscaper but I'll do them as well as separate videos, setting them up with, with them as well. Just gives another great reason for if you were considering um, an MP, any type of MP controller, a seaboard block, which is the, uh, the, the, the cheapest one. Um, but it's very lucky Roly have sent me. I'm doing also as well Equator Full. They sent me Equator Full to review as well. So although I've, I've only got this, so you get the Equator Player kind of thing when you get this. Um, I asked them to send me Equator Full so I could show you guys the, the the kind of full sound set in that and the desktop software as well. Okay, uh, thanks for watching. The link's in the description um, for GarageBand, which is 100% and completely free. It always amazes me. The Noise app is free, and you do get, like, the Fundamentals pack, which is there's loads of cool stuff in there for free as well. Plus there's some of the free bits and pieces and all. Um, and it, it will work, of course, with... Um, if I just go back to this, sorry, if I go back to, I also have it midi'd up, it does work, I'm sorry, it does work with a standard midi controller, but I have to control the actual expression with the, um, what's it, the modulation wheel. I think it's marvellous. I, I, I think it's just great. Okay, uh, thank you for watching and I will see you guys later.